is my life. What? I didn't say anything. You didn't? No, I didn't. I feel like you did, but you say so. Nope. Okay. Yo. Chill, man. I'm chill. Okay. Hey, I am chill. Okay. I am. Okay. I am. Okay. If you don't mind, I'm gonna chill with you on the bench. It's been a long night. Shit's crazy. Like all of it. Yeah. So what are we gonna do? What? You and me, what are we gonna do? Sorry? You and me. Us. <laughs> Look, I'm... <laughs> nah. It, it's cool. I'm just being rhetorical. Oh. Oh, my God. What were you thinking? I wasn't thinking. <laughs> I... Uh, yeah, you were. Uh, no. I get it. I thought it was a black thing, but... You thought I was gay. No. And that I, I was trying to make a move that. on you. No. <laughs> oh no, no, shit. I, <laughs> no. I, That's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> nah, nah. I'm straight for real. You can trust me on that. Full stop. Full stop. But if we were in jail. Somebody's got to be somebody's bitch, am I right? Damn, you are so white. <laughs> Where are you from? Not here. Is anybody from here? Yeah, me. Oh, yeah. Well, n no, I'm not originally. No shit. Wait, you Mormon? Ha, no. I'm from Indiana, not Utah. Oh, okay. That's different. It's like apples. And other apples. It is different. <laughs> okay. What's your name? Mitch? Blaine? Seth? <laughs> I'm Duran. That's like Darren, only black. Okay. I'm just playing. <laughs> but it is Duran, though. So. Tyler. Oh. Tyler. Well. There's all kinds of vanilla. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm gonna go, so you have a good night. I'm just messing with you. Sorry? I know, people are so scared these days, on, on edge. I didn't mean anything. Sit down. Damn. I mean, I gotta keep an eye on you so you don't call the popo on me. I'm <laughs> kidding. Man, seriously. <laughs> it's cool. Popo. Okay, yeah, all right. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Racists are assholes. They ruin it for everyone. Yeah, I know. I'm not racist. I know. Okay. 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 And I'm not gay. Yeah, I know. Okay. So, what is up with you? What do you mean? I mean, tonight, what's up with you? Why is Opie sitting alone at the park this time of night? A clean cut lad like you? What's your story? I really... Oh, come on, dude. <laughs> we both here, I don't know you, you don't know me. If there was ever a time for just shooting the shit, it's not like we ever gonna hang again, right? Probably. Nah, definitely. You never know. I do. Oh. Okay, well, stranger things have happened is all. Now that is some truth. <laughs> yeah. So, you tell me all about your white problems, I'll tell you all about my black ones. Why does it have to be all about black and white? <laughs> exactly. So tell me. The doctor was in. We have established you are from Utah. Indiana. Right. <laughs> well, I just don't know what my life is right now. Mm-hmm. I had all these plans. I was set. 
and now it's like everything just blew up. Well, shit. I know. So, what do you want? I don't know. I used to know what I wanted. At least I think I did. I went to college in Boston, fell in love a few times, and then I studied acting. And then I met, well, I moved here with what I thought was the right person, shared the rent on a stabilized apartment three different ways. Wow, you had the hookup. Yeah, or so I thought. I was auditioning, not getting anything yet, but still making okay money working as a waiter, of course. So? So? So you're gay. I didn't say that. I know, and I'm wondering why, because who gives a shit? Okay, so I am gay, but I really hate that just because I'm a waiter slash actor living in New York City, you assume I'm gay. It's really not relevant. It's not? No. Oh, okay. Well, go on. Back to Tyler's big adventure. <sighs> well, it turns out my boyfriend is having an affair with his high school chorus teacher in Connecticut every weekend. What? Yeah. I went through his bag and found a card detailing their secret torrid affair. And here's the kicker. The teacher is married to a woman. What? Yeah, so I brought it up to Josh and he gets all mad at me for going through his stuff like I'm the problem. Really? Fucked up. Yeah, and his lesbian best friend, who is our third roommate, takes his side and is like, how dare you? Meanwhile, her screaming bipolar girlfriend is living in the apartment with us six months rent free. <sighs> Bitch. The, the, the situation, not the lesbian. Yeah, well, all three of them gang up on me. Damn. I know. Oh, but wait, they say I have a week to get out. You gotta go. Right? So yeah, I have four days and still haven't found a place yet. Single, broke, and homeless. <laughs> Welcome to the big city. And your parents? I can't ask them for help. They wouldn't anyway. They're not okay with any of it, which is fine because I'm not okay with any of them either. You know, I'm not trying to say anything, but it seems to me down low affairs with chorus teachers and bipolar lesbians, it all feels like being gay is pretty fucking relevant. Just saying, a side note. I guess. Nah, that's a straight up gay New York City story. Lucky me. <laughs> well, don't sweat it. Everybody goes through it at the beginning in New York. I just think it means you're meant to be here is all. It's a test. You don't get to call yourself a real New Yorker till you walk through the fire. You'll be okay. Don't give up. I won't. I just don't know how I'm going to survive New York City. NYC. <laughs> this is just the cushy Upper West Side of Manhattan. Charlie. You've got a golden ticket, and you've only just stepped into the chocolate factory, son. It's about to get weird and wonderful and be a psychedelic trip into the scary unknown beautiful. I love Gene Wilder. I know, <laughs> right? <laughs> Original Willy Wonka was the shit. <laughs> They done fucked it up with that new movie version, though. There's still no fucking black people. Worldwide lottery. Every country and only white people won those tickets. <laughs> yeah, okay. No chocolate in a chocolate factory. <laughs> wow, that is true. I never even noticed that. That is fucked up. Every day. But I know you have your shit to deal with, too. I get it. Well, yeah, I mean, of course I do, but it's not like yours. <laughs> what do you mean? Uh, I, I didn't, uh, I didn't. Uh, just fuck with you. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I'm black. <sighs> True that. If a gay person gets scared, they can put on that invisibility cloak of straightness and live in a closet. <laughs> what if black people could be in the closet? There'd be a national uh, black coming out day. <laughs> like, hey, mom, dad, 
I'm black. Oh, dear God. What did we do to make you this way? Was it my cooking? I should have been there for you, son. I should have seen the signs, the rap music, the basketball, the obsession with big, juicy butts. How could I have missed it? I failed you as a father. Oh, my baby boy, I failed you. Your life will be so hard now. Are you sure you want to be black? Is it a phase? But why? Why would you choose this? It's not a choice, damn it. Why would I choose to be black? I like taking taxis like everyone else. Oh, God. I just want you to know, no matter what, I love you, my black son. <laughs> You are so stupid. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Sorry, was I? Nah, I... that shit was funny. <laughs> like, not really, but. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so, <laughs> when is it your turn? What? Your turn to tell me why you're in Riverside Park at midnight talking to some white gay guy on a bench. Well, one, I was fucked up. Too much weed and drinks with my boys, hanging out. And they left my ass to go hook up with a couple of NYU chicas. They met at the bar. Just wasn't my night, I guess. Two, wait, you never told me why you were out here alone in the park. I didn't? No. Nah. Uh, fresh air. Stop playing. <laughs> you was here for a hookup. What, grinder? <sighs> Scruff. Damn. <laughs> I knew it. And gays got to take care of their business, too. Hey, you do you. I just wanted to escape for a while. Feel something wanted, I guess. I don't know. Maybe I'm just tired of being hurt and angry. I don't see why that's so wrong, even if it is just a hookup, an escape, a quick distraction before I have to go back to my shitty apartment situation tonight. No luck though, huh? <laughs> no, just a lot of big talk and no shows. Hey, no judgments. <laughs> back to you, why are you here at midnight? Fresh air. Okay. <laughs> nah, uh, really. Fresh air. I just need to breathe. I go out every Friday night, uh, the clubs, getting fucked up with my boys. <laughs> Sometimes I just want something else. I get so sick of the same shit. It's proving myself. The game, gotta be player. Ladies fall for it. And they say they don't, but they do. <laughs> There's so many rules. I live by so many fucking rules. Gots to be tougher, stronger, smarter, better. Better than you, but not too much better. You know, know my place, be nice, yet you know, be gangster, let them know. Just don't offend. Stand up for what you believe, but sit down and behave. Crazy shit. You know, I'm pre-med. Yeah, at Columbia. <laughs> Look at your face. Pretending not to be shocked. No worries, man. Shit is shocking to me. But I mean, why? Why should I be shocked? I'm, I work hard as hell, I'm fucking smart. Educated, articulate, I have goals. Damn. I'm not supposed to succeed because of my background, right? I, I wasn't chosen, so. I had to choose my motherfucking self. I got in the ring, I chose to fight for myself, to go round after round, after round, knowing that the odds are stacked against me and that the fight will never really be over. This world, 
walking the fucking tightrope, shielding myself, carrying the weight of history. This, the news I have to deal with, the daily realities I have to face, goddamn, every fucking day. Every day. And even my folks, the fucking pressure of what they expect. My dad, he doesn't even see me as a real man. No, he don't give a shit that I'm trying to make something out of myself. Really, he resents it. Thinks smart equals soft. <laughs> he probably thinks I'm gay. Oh, I wish I was. Just to make them have to deal with that toxic bullshit. Hey, Dad. I just got turned in the park by this white boy rocking my motherfucking gay world. Deal with that, Pop. I'ma be an uh, out gay doctor, marry a white guy, get a fucking Labrador. Go hiking or I, I don't know. Do some real white gay shit. Deal with that, pop. Deal with all that rainbow. Shit. Okay. What? Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Um, maybe if you're going full stereotype, you could include musicals. I mean, that would kill him. <laughs> yeah, musicals. <laughs> right. Um, Duran, not that you care what I think, and I know I just met you, but you seem like a pretty amazing person to me. Man. Shut up. <laughs> what are you doing? I told you, I am not gay. <laughs> nope, I know. No worries, really. It's all okay. <laughs> it's just, I'm from Utah, remember? <laughs> <laughs> You're so stupid. <laughs> Oh. oh, okay, mm -hmm. this is, um... Aren't you afraid of being seen? Oh, no, man. I feel like... Aren't you afraid of not being seen?